Hello everybody and welcome to the card for Night of Champions. I'm Jimmy Ventura and with me is Gorilla Metal. Hello, Jimmy Ventura, the Night of Champions, one of the last stops on the road to WrestleMania in the JFW universe. And it's a very special pay-per-view. Five matches, five championships, five champions, and possibly five new title holders. Could be a wild one. There are our champions on your screen now. Let's run through the card. First up, we have... Papa Piccolo, your plim plum pluserweight champion, taking on the freelancer Antsy. He's not drawing a JFW paycheck, but he got himself a title match. But it ain't just any title match. He's going to have to ascend a ladder and get his grubby mitts all over the plim plum pluserweight championship. If he wants to walk away a champion, he still won't get paid for it. But that's how we like it. What do you think of this one, Jimmy? It, it should be great, shouldn't it? Ansi has been a constant thorn in, in the uh, side of the Ferrero Rocher <laughs> Papa Piccolo. <laughs> he sure has, but good lord, do I worry about a guy like Ansi in a ladder match. He has a history of taking some pretty nasty falls. That's true. That's true. He'll be in his element, though, won't he? <laughs> Absolutely. All right, let's move it right along to our very next match. <laughs> <laughs> and here it is, your two heads champions, Das Hats, uh, arguably or inarguably, really, the greatest tag team of JFW history going up against whatever that is on your screen there. It's Elp and Humorous Chimp. Uh, Lean Gary and Oriolensis were granted the right to name their opponents, and they had the cream of the crop to select. Dance, Dance, Revolution on a tear, dress for business, really coming back to form. But they chose these two losers, maybe trying to pad the stats there, you know, a little <laughs> dirty maneuvering by Doss Hats. Who knows what's going on, but somehow, someway, Humorous Chimp and Elp Meme are getting a pay-per-view check. What do you think, Jim? Yeah, well, I mean, don't forget, El Elp and Chimp just put themselves into the matches, didn't they, you know? So I guess that maybe... Uh, maybe Das Hats just felt like they had to give them this shot. And uh, on the other hand as well, you know, they had the opportunity. So what, why defend it against somebody better? <laughs> uh, very, I mean, hey, very, very, very good logic there. You know, Lean Gary uh, calling them out on Friday. Stand firm. Maybe just assuming they're not going to stop. Uh, so they might, <laughs> might as well just try and end it once and for all on Sunday. But let us, let us not diminish the fact that Humorous Chimp and Elp Meme winning their matches in solo pairings this week. So the champs are coming in a little dinged up. Uh, a lot of question marks there, but I got to believe the country wizard and lean Gary are going to rock and roll at this pay-per-view. You would absolutely hope so. Yeah. <laughs> All right. And oh, oh baby, look at this slate battling for the Wem dope title. It is a four way table Elimination match, your undefeated champion, Mystery. He's got three competitors coming in that ran the gauntlet to get there. Fault Force, Purple Chest, and Mr. Glorious himself, Jimmy. Fantastic. They're going to have to put each other through tables and walk away. Uh, well, hopefully walk away, maybe crawl away, a uh, champion, the Wem Dope title, the prettiest belt in professional wrestling. Who's your pick to take this one, Jim? <laughs> uh, oh, boy. Well, my pick is obvious, isn't it? It's got to be the glorious one, the savior of the JFW. It, you know, it's surely, surely he should win this one easily. <laughs> Uh, I, well, you know, it's it's hard to bet against him, that's for sure. But I'm going to go with a dark horse in this one. I think, and I don't just mean because of his blindfolds, I think Purple Chest is coming away. Your Wem Dope champion tomorrow night at Night of Champions. He has come so close to that title in the past with one of the best matches we've seen put on against Night Demon when he was a long-standing champion. I think tonight is his night. And he is going to walk away with the Wem Dope title. Yeah, I mean, that's fair. And don't forget the other three guys have got a lot of mass on them, haven't they? A lot more mass than Jimmy. So that's, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's certainly going to be harder to pick up and put and, through and, those tables. 
Sure thing, and it's going to be really hard to pick up Fall Force with the amount of baby oil he wears and then putting him on a table. If he slides off that thing, you're not going to have an easy time getting him through it. Absolutely. So we will see which man will be the last man standing in this four-man table elimination match. And here we go, folks. It If it wasn't official before, it is now the World Heavyweight Championship title match is no longer JBG versus Night Demon. That's right. Flicky Flack with the Hail Mary of all Hail Marys on Friday. Stand firm with his incredibly persuasive PowerPoint protection presentation as to why he should be in this match has earned him a spot in this match night demon part of the unholy alliance with mr Jim mcmahon he's got the backing of the big boss coming after the yorkie jbg in his title and flicky flack will be there too this could be an epic match it sure should um you know like night demon's been on an absolute tear hasn't he uh, JBG's been carrying the YPA and sure has. <laughs> Flicky Flack has just given us one of the all time great PowerPoint presentations. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that uh, you, you talk about talking your way into success. He did that on Friday, stand firm. The most passionate, you know, heartfelt presentation you'll ever see. Folks, go back and check the VOD if you haven't seen it yet. Flicky Flack vying for greatness, but he has got a lot in his way and i don't think any of these men is walking away that isn't named night demon and you know part of six feet down under in the unholy alliance he's my pick to take that title at night of champions next slide please <laughs> <laughs> and here we go folks the extra arms belt Ooh, the YPA, this weird casual implosion with uh, literally Sean Bean <laughs> coming out of Bean Manor and calling out Foxamania for underperforming uh, for uh, all of represent or for representing all of Yorkshire. And then on Monday, Claw Tri came out said, "You can add yourself to the match all you want. I will fight any person at all." from Yorkshire to keep my title. And he said it with a lot more uh, gravitas than I'm able to, <laughs> to, to muster right now. But try Fific one gay and his small package are going to look to keep their arms, all three of them on the extra arms belt and walk away champion in the main event of night of champions. What a match this should be. This has been added as an elimination match since literally Sean Bean added himself to the match. They changed the step. It should be a crazy one. Yeah, it's got to be an amazing match, isn't it? I mean, God, elimination's always great. And uh, yeah, Sean you got Bean. <laughs> It's always you gotta, <laughs> you gotta wonder: Are the Yorkshiremen gonna work together? Is Try gonna sit back and watch him fight it out? Some some dirty words were said by Sean Bean the other day. You know, I don't know what Foxamania's frame of mind is gonna be. This should be a dramatic uh, explosion in your main event of the night, and folks. That is going to be your card for Night of Champions. Tune in with us right here on Jimmy Fantastic's Twitch at 10 p.m. UTC, Sunday, February 28th. I will see you all then. Thank you, as always, for having me, Jimmy Ventura. My name is Gorilla Metso, and I'll see you guys Sunday night. Glorious. Thank you very much, Gorilla. Thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.